I was in Chickasha, Oklahoma about a couple days ago. So I'm pulling out of Taco Bell. I know I'm a scumbag. Diet's never gonna do anything right. So I got a breakfast burrito. So I'm pulling out of Taco Bell, right? So there's a car right here, right? So imagine this, this is the street. There's a car right here. I pull up like this. So I'm waiting with my blinker. A third car comes in behind the car that I'm waiting behind. And this, this woman is just looking at her phone. She doesn't see me, right? She's an inattentive driver. So I'm just thinking to myself, I said, you know what? I could just let her go and, you know, she didn't see me. But I said, fuck that because you need to see me. I need to be seen. Uh, you need to respect other people, those around you. And this bitch obviously does it. So she's inching behind the car, oblivious to the world, playing with her stupid phone. And I'm just kind of like, wow, whatever. So just as the car, the lead car goes out to the street, I pull right in front of her. Boom. And she just stopped like this. And she gets, and she flips me off. And I look at this bitch and I said, you know, she's really ugly. She's like a negative 11. And, you know, I got a rule. I treat everybody the same when it comes to like road rage or stuff like that. Like, I'm not going to say or do anything to a woman that I wouldn't do to a grown ass man that could kick my ass. So I, I looked at her and I said, open your eyes. Stop playing with your phone. And then I pulled out and then she, <clears throat> whatever. And let me explain why you should never let maggots like that win. Because if nobody corrects this person's behavior in public, she's going to continue to be a douchebag on the road forever and ever and ever uh, until the end, right? So instead of letting scum like that prosper in society by barging in front of people, whether you're cutting in line, you're being the douchebag, you're driving on the shoulder in traffic. No, you should always do your best job to prevent somebody from being a douchebag. You don't want them being able to constantly do this to other people because it's just not right. It's not fair. Uh, I am a moral judge when it comes to character uh, and societal norms and how to you know, be a productive human being. And when she flipped me off, you know, I expected that from her because she was ugly. And normally ugly women are treated very ugly by ugly men or just, you know, guys that just, you know, they're being assholes. A cute chick would have never, can you imagine a cute chick that flips you off? I mean, what cute chick out there other than Scarlett would flip somebody off for just no good reason whatsoever? I have no clue. But a cute chick, a beautiful woman, a decent looking chick, they never do any kind of vulgar hand signs like that at all. It's always like the ugly ones, the unattractive ones. So I don't know. I just had to explain myself. You know what I'm saying? Maybe I'll start the diet tomorrow.